toys and dolls. <laughs> Is it just me or do you smell something burning? <laughs> Uh, is someone cooking something in the oven? Cause whatever that's in the oven is burning. <coughs> oh, there's so much smoke. <coughs> okay, we better turn off the oven before we have a fire situation. <coughs> oh my god, whatever that's in the oven is burning. Your mom or your dad must have put something in the oven and forgot about it. Max, please step back. <coughs> oh, there's so much smoke. Max, step back, step back, boy. It's dangerous. <coughs> okay, I gotta get whatever that's in the oven out. <coughs> I think that's a turkey. You might want to put on some oven mitts, honey, to protect your hands. All right, let's put on some oven mitts. Because whatever that's in the oven is going to be super hot. So we got two oven mitts. <coughs> oh, there's a lot of smoke. <coughs> oh, and it was a turkey in the oven. And is that a pie down there? I think your parents put the turkey and the pie in the oven and forgot about it. So now it's all burnt. Okay, I'll have to take it out. <coughs> oh. oh, there's so much smoke. Yeah, the turkey is all burnt. <coughs> We're not going to be able to eat this for dinner tonight. <coughs> all the meat is burnt to a crisp. It's not going to be healthy to eat. So <coughs> we're going to have to throw this away. And the pie is all burnt too. Oh, what a shame. Uh -oh. <coughs> oh, I love me some good pie, but we're going to have to throw this away. What's going on? What's going on? Did the fire alarm go off? Oh no. The pie! Oh, the turkey! I completely forgot about it! I put it in the oven before you guys got here! Oh no, the turkey is all burnt! What are we gonna have for dinner now? Yeah, Dad, you almost burnt down the house! Something smells funny! Did something burn? Yeah, is there a fire? <gasps> is that the pie? Oh no! Yeah, it looks like the pie and the turkey are burnt. Oh no, we don't have another turkey. What are we going to eat for dinner tonight? Oh, your mother's going to kill me. I knew I forgot something. <sighs> I am getting so old. Can't even remember where my glasses are anymore these days. <gasps> Does that mean there's no more pie for dinner? And we're not going to have any turkey anymore? But, but then, what are we going to eat for dinner then? Maybe we can still eat it. Uh, I guess we can't because it's all burnt. Everything is burnt. Well, since the turkey is all burnt, maybe we can just eat ice cream for dinner. Or can we eat pizza instead? I like pepperoni pizza, Hawaiian pizza. I like all pizzas. Yeah, let's eat ice cream and pizza instead. Looks like the pie is all burnt. We're not going to be able to have any pie for dinner. Uh oh. Oh, but I wanted Grandma's pie. Grandma makes the bestest pie in the whole world. Oh, I also wanted pie. Uh, can we just bake another pie, please? Mom, he said that if we came over to Grandma's house, that there would be pie to eat. And now there's no pie. Maybe the inside is still okay, even though the outside looks super yucky. Ew, I'm not gonna eat that. It's all burnt and yucky looking. Maybe we can go to the supermarket and get a new pie. Because I really wanted to eat some pie for dinner. Dessert is like the best part of dinner. Can we just go to the supermarket and get a new pie? Sorry kids, unfortunately there's just too much snow outside. So we're not going to be able to go to the supermarket. But hey look, we still have this cake. So we'll have some cake later. Yay! Yeah! Even though it's not pie, but I like cake more anyways. It's strawberry cake, my favorite! Yay! At least the oven is not smoking anymore. <sighs> that was a close one there. Uh -oh. <coughs> <coughs> what is going on? Is everything okay? 
Oh no, the turkey and my pie. It's all ruined, all burnt. Oh my, my, my. Don't worry about it, Mom. Just go back to the living room and relax. We got it all under control. We can make something quickly for dinner. It looks like Dad put in a turkey and your pie into the oven earlier and he must have forgotten about it because it's all burnt. We're just gonna throw that away. Don't worry, my wife and I will figure something out for us to eat for dinner. You just go ahead and rest. Sorry, honey. I uh, uh, kind of um, uh, forgot about the turkey and the pie, so... Well, that's that. You know, I'm getting really forgetful these days. I can't even remember where my glasses are anymore. My goodness. <sighs> Harry, how many times do I have to tell you? Your... <coughs> I am too sick for this. Your glasses is on your head. <coughs> what? What'd you say? Oh man, now my hearing is all off. Could be because you're sick too. H honey, have you seen where my glasses are? I have no idea where I put them. Your glasses are on your head, silly. I told you that earlier. My goodness, you are losing your knockers. You can't seem to remember anything anymore these days. Your glasses are on your head, Harry. Don't worry, Mom. Don't worry, Dad. There's no need to fight. I'm sure it was just an accident that could have happened to anyone. Why don't you guys go into the living room, play with Midnight, Midnight Boy, and Midnight Baby, and I'll figure out something for dinner. <sighs> oh, this is so embarrassing. I invited you kids here for dinner, and I have nothing prepared. You kids are... <coughs> You kids also helped us clean up. Oh, I am so sorry. <coughs> if only I hadn't caught this awful, awful flu. Mom, you need to go into the living room and just rest. Your flu is pretty bad. You know what? I'm going to heat up this kettle, get some boiling water going, and I'll make you some... Uh, honey tea for your throat. That should help you feel better. Okay, let's make some tea. I'll put this on. Should I put it on medium or high heat? I'll put it on high heat. I'm thinking since my mom is sick, maybe we can eat something with soup base. That way it'll be easier for her to eat or like porridge. Well, okay, I'll see what I can do. We do have quite a bit of these noodles. So maybe I'll make us some noodles for dinner. But one package is not going to be enough. Luckily, your parents have a lot of noodles. So I will just make some noodles for us. Some noodle soup. That way there will be soup involved. First, we're going to have to cook the noodles. So we'll put it in a pot. And then I'm just gonna put some water so that we can boil this noodle. Okay, we got some water in the pot. It's so heavy. And we'll turn this up. Whenever I need to make a quick dinner, I always go to this noodle soup recipe. It's easy peasy. Oh, oh, oh no. Is it burning? I better stir it so that the noodles doesn't stick to the pot. Okay, I'll turn down the heat so that it doesn't overcook the noodles. Oh, I don't want the noodles to stick to the pan, so I'm going to stir it. What should we play? Let's play with this rattle. Midnight Baby loves this rattle toy. I hope you grow up fast so that in the future we can play together, baby sister. Oh, do you want this rattle? <laughs> do you want this? Midnight Baby is so cute. <laughs> Dollface was so jealous earlier because she wants a little sister or a little brother. But she can't have ours. Midnight Baby is ours. Hey, right? Yeah, you're our little baby sister. We would never give you away. 
<laughs> Do you want this rattle toy? Cooking some meat for our noodle soup. I don't want it to burn, so I got some meat here and I also got some fish. So that way there are options. This should be done any minute now. Cooking can be so relaxing. Oh, I better turn this and flip it so that it doesn't burn. Okay, I think that looks pretty good. This is the meat and the fish for our noodle soup. I might just cook it a little bit more. Okay, turn off the heat. All done. And now, I'll just set this aside until our broth is finished. I'll put this aside. When you grow bigger, I'm going to show you all of my favorite dinosaurs and all my favorite car toys and we can play together. And I have a lot of dollhouses and we can play with all of my dollhouses together. Oh, oh hey, look, she's holding into my hand. Wow, ow, 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 that hurts, Midnight. Okay, we also have some veggies here to put into our noodle soup, but our vegetables are not washed yet and they're looking kind of dirty. So first I have to wash these veggies before I cut them up. So I'm just going to wash them in the sink. Really have to give them a good rinse. Make it very thorough because we don't want any dirt or worse, any worms. Okay, I'm going to do a second rinse. Since I already dumped out the water, I'm going to rinse it again. Now we're going to cut the veggies. Cut the veggies into smaller portions. Almost done cutting these veggies. Okay, they're smaller now, so they'll be easier to eat. Now we're just going to throw the veggies into our soup. There we go. I'm just going to stir, give this a nice big stir. And I got more veggies to put into the soup. Give it a good stir. Whew, it's starting to smell really good. Dinner's almost ready. Oh, here's the newspaper. I didn't get to read the morning news today, so I'm going to read it right now. Mm, the words are so small. I can't see anything without my glasses. Oh, if only I knew where my glasses are. Oh my goodness, Harry. For the gazillion time today, your glasses are on your head. You've had it on your head the entire day and you've been asking about it all day. Oh, here they are. <laughs> Silly me. Okay, that's better. I can see much clearer now. Whoa, look at these cruise ship prices. They're at an all-time low. Maybe we can go. My memory is not what it used to be. I am starting to get really forgetful these days. Are there any news about real estate prices? I've been thinking, Harry. Maybe we should downsize and move closer to the kids. You know, I've actually been thinking of the same thing. Let's see what the real estate news is today. Grandma! Grandpa! Midnight Baby is crying! She's probably hungry again. We should feed her so that she'll grow bigger faster. Oh no, is Midnight Baby crying? Oh dear, okay. Let Grandpa feed her then. Oh no, she must be hungry. She hasn't eaten anything since she got here. Hurry, Harry, feed Midnight Baby. I guess the good thing about being sick is that you have to take care of all of the chores until I get better. <laughs> mm, mm, do I need more salt or pepper? Mm, I can't really tell. I think I need more salt, but since I've been tasting a lot of this, I can't tell anymore. Okay, maybe I'll just put a little bit more salt because I don't want it to be bland. Okay, let me just stir it so that it's even. Oh, 
Crocker Boy, I really can't tell. Do you think you can help me? Can you try out the noodle soup broth and let me know if I need more salt? Yeah, of course, honey. I can help you with that. You know what my friends always say, that I have the tongue of a chef. Even though I'm not a chef. But yeah. Okay, let me stir and get you a, a nice big spoon. Here you go. Ah. Uh, Hmm. It's pretty good, but I think it does need a bit more salt and I would put in a bit more pepper too, but close pretty good Okay, more salt then Let me stir it Make sure it's even and now I'll put in some pepper And then I'll also stir it Make sure it's even Okay, here, honey, I put in some salt and pepper. Can you try again, please? All right. Mmm, yeah, that's much better. Although, I think you could go with a little bit more salt and a little bit more pepper. Okay, I just don't want it to be salty. Okay, a bit more pepper. I think that's enough. I don't want the soup to be too salty, so I think this should be good. Mmm, that is really good. Okay, I think our noodle soup is perfect the way it is right now. Okay, let's test out this milk. Make sure it's not too hot or cold. And okay, I know, I know. You're probably very hungry. Grandpa is gonna be feeding you today. Oh, poor thing. You must have been so hungry. Oh, she's drinking up the milk so fast. She really was so hungry. Oh, there, there. Wow, you are a big eater. You must take from your grandma. <laughs> okay, looks like she's done. Oh, there, there, there. How do I burp a baby? Honey, can you show me how to burp a baby? Honey, I think your water is boiled. Oh, yay. Okay, is it done? Can you turn off the heat for me, please, honey? Yup, looks like the kettle is done. Now I can make my mom some honey tea with this hot water. She's been coughing a lot, so I know her throat must be itchy. You know what? Change of thought. I'm gonna make her some ginger tea instead. That way, it'll help her relieve her throat and make her feel better since she's been coughing a lot all day. Okay, put this back. Oh, Mom! Grandma, do you wanna play tag? Now let's play hide and seek. Oh dear, Grandma is a little too sick today. Why don't we read a book? Just look how cool this book is! And I know how much you kids love dinosaurs! Especially Midnight Boy! Look! Look at all the dinosaurs! There's even a big river here! And a lot of volcanoes! Wow! This is my favorite book ever! There's dinosaurs! That's a T-Rex, Grandma! Oh! And this is a volcano! I love dinosaurs! My favorite is a T-Rex! T-Rex are the biggest meat eaters of all the dinosaurs! Midnight Boy really likes dinosaurs! He's always talking about them! But, but, I like princesses and castles more, Grandma! Grandma, I think that's a Triceratop! Hey! You're in front of me, Midnight Boy! I can't see! That's not fair! Oh, what's that? Midnight, midnight boy. Grandma needs to rest. She has the flu. Why don't you two play amongst yourselves now? Oh, that's quite all right. I feel better already. And besides, we're just reading a book. They're no trouble at all. Okay, mom, if you say so, just try not to strain yourself. Oh, here, I made you some ginger tea for your throat. That should help you feel better. And I can watch over Midnight and Midnight Boy for you while you drink tea. You really shouldn't be overexerting yourself, you know, since you have the flu and all. 
Oh, Ginger Tea, thank you very much. I used to make this for you when you were a baby. And now you're making it for me. <laughs> ah. Ah. How the times have changed. This is very good. Okay, dinner is almost ready. I'm just gonna scoop the soup for everyone. That's one bowl. Now for another bowl. This bowl has a lot of shrimp in it because I know grandma loves shrimp. And I love the really big shrimp. So I'm gonna take this bowl. Dinner's ready! Bon appetit everyone! Dinner is served. I did use different noodles for everyone though, so let me know what you think. Mmm, this looks really good. Thanks, honey. Wow. Mm, I was in the mood for noodle soup too. Oh, this just smells delicious. You're gonna have to give me the recipe for this noodle soup later. My, my, my. Thank you so much, Shadow, for making us dinner. I feel so embarrassed inviting you kids for dinner and not being able to cook you any dinner. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. That's delicious. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's try this. That is delicious, Shadow. You'll have to give me the recipe. Really? Is it good? Do you all like it? Yeah? Yeah, it's really good, honey. Mmm, yum. The noodles are delicious. And the soup, too. It's just perfect. Mom, Shadow makes the best noodle soup, doesn't she? This is the best noodle soup that I have ever had. Really? Let me try a piece then. Wow. I really made this really good today. And since today is mom's birthday, we can't forget the birthday cake. We got strawberry cake. Is everyone done dinner already? Because if we're done eating, then we gotta have some birthday cake for dessert. And we gotta sing you the birthday song, mom. Oh, you kids are too sweet. Is that cake for me? Oh my, that cake is as big as my head. It's huge. Oh, you don't have to worry about that. We have Midnight and Midnight Boy. They love cake. They'll finish it all. Wait, wait, wait. Before we sing your birthday song, we gotta put candles on your cake. Okay, the candles are on. Now we can sing Grandma her birthday song. Okay, sing along, everyone. <laughs> A wonderful birthday. Thank you for being here. Mom, you can't blow out the candles yet. You have to make a wish. But don't tell us what your wish is or it won't come true. Make a wish before you blow out the candles. Oh, a wish. Oh my. Let's see. What should I wish for? Oh, I know. I have the perfect wish. I wish for... Time to blow out the candles. Uh-oh. <laughs> One and now another one. <laughs> hey, Grandma is supposed to blow out the candles. It's not your birthday, Midnight Boy. Oh, no. You're supposed to let Grandma blow out her candles. Now her wish won't come true. Really? Uh oh. Uh, sorry. <laughs> 
Grandma, I didn't mean to. I want your wish to come true. Maybe you can make it again. I'm sorry. Oh, no, no, Midnight Boy. There's nothing to cry about. You are just helping me. I'm sure my wish will still come true. It's okay. Please don't cry. Wipe those tears away. And turn that frown upside down since it's Grandma's birthday. Midnight is such a crybaby. I never cry, but Midnight cries all the time. Nah, -uh, that's not true. You're the one that cries all the time. Don't believe her, Grandma. Oh my, it's okay to cry when you're sad. That's perfectly normal. Let's just cut this cake so we can enjoy some delicious cake. My favorite part of the cake is the frosting. Okay, let's give you some extra frosting. I want a big piece, please, Grandma. Can you please cut me the biggest, biggest, biggest piece, please? Okay, let's see. I'll just cut this part. I also want a lot of cake. I want a bigger slice than midnight. Please, Grandma. No, I want a bigger piece, Grandma. Midnight Boy has cavities, so he should have a smaller piece. Nuh uh, but I'm older. I need to eat more. Please, Grandma. Nuh uh. Please, please, kids. You're going to give Grandma and I a headache. We're all going to get an even slice of cake. Nobody's pieces is going to be bigger than anybody's. We're all going to share this cake and it's all going to be even. Yes, Mommy. Mmm, yum. I got a lot of frosting on mine. Thanks, Grandma. With Midnight Baby, we're going to be able to eat cake more because we have an extra birthday. Yay! Happy birthday, Mom. Here is a gift from Shadow and I and the kids. We picked it earlier today. Hope you like it. Oh, what's this? A present? Oh my, thank you, thank you. What could it be? Oh, wow. Pearl necklace. This is beautiful. I was looking for a pearl necklace too. Wow, how did you know? Mm, it's so hard to eat. With a fork, I'm going to use my mouth. How does it look? It fits perfectly. Oh, it looks so elegant. Thank you, thank you, kids. I love it. Happy birthday, Grandma. You're supposed to use your fork. <laughs> you got strawberry all over your face. You're supposed to use your fork, silly. I can just wipe it off. See, ta-da! Oh no, it looks like it's snowing again outside. OMG, how are we going to get home now? It's snowing again. Oh, there's just going to be so much snow on the road. We better go home before it gets out of hand. Look at all this snow. What? It's snowing again? Oh man. Okay, Mom, happy birthday, but I think we gotta head out now because it's snowing again and there's gonna be a lot of snow on the road. We better get going. Oh my, it's snowing again and there's so much snow. It makes me worry to think that you kids will be driving home with a newborn baby and kids in that snowstorm. Are you sure you kids don't want to stay the night? Normally, it would be no problem for us to stay the night, but now that we have Midnight Baby, all of the baby stuff is at home, so we better go home. Uh, we better leave now. Sorry, Mom. Oh, we're gonna have to drive really slowly. Look at all the snow. Let's get going before it snows a lot more. There's gonna be a huge snowstorm tonight, so I don't think it's gonna stop snowing anytime soon. It looks like today's weather is on and off snow. Let's go home now while we still can. Press that subscribe button and ring the bell. That way when a video is released, you'll be the first to watch it. Watch more of my toy videos by going to the search button and pressing in Minky Toys and Dolls or just Minky Toys. Lots of fun doll videos for you here.